Hello everybody and uh, welcome to my 8th uh, Microsoft Access 2013 tutorial. And this tutorial I'm going to show you how you import a table from a, another database. Uh, so very similar to the link table, uh, the difference being that the data is not going to go back again to the previous database. So if we press on uh, our external data and then access. Uh, and then we're going to go to browse and find the same table that we wanted before. So I want one from table five and my database. Click OK and then we want the items table. Press OK. Uh, so we've imported now the table. It's going to ask us do we want to save the import steps. Um, and so I'm going to put save import steps uh, and um, you can save it into your Outlook if you want that reminds you when it's time to do it uh, and you can just run it straight from Outlook which is really useful. Um, so let's save the import. Uh, so now we've got this items table uh, and it's just created a whole fresh new table there that we can use. Um, if you then click on your saved imports, uh, you can just click on this uh, and you can click on run uh, and it will just update the import. Um, so that's quite a useful one. It will create it as a new table though. So uh, if you want it to overdo the old table, we have to delete it first. Uh, but that's how you import data from uh, an uh, external database. Um, it, that's going to be it for this tutorial, quite a quick one, it's a very easy thing to do. If you've got any questions, check them in the uh, comments below. Uh, and in the next tutorial, I'll show you how you can uh, import from Excel or a text file. So thanks for listening, and I hope to catch you in the next tutorial.